Hey you guys! Good morning. Actually, it's like 2, almost 3, so I guess it's not good morning. I got ready late. I woke up late. I was like, ooh, I'm going to get up at 8.30 and I'm going to get my day started because it's going to be another pretty day, but I didn't end up doing that, so. You know what? I guess better late than never because I was really excited to vlog today for you guys. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing today, but something, you know, something regular schmuggler, you know, but. <laughs> this is an amazing cookie, why? Because you ate that all by yourself and that was not a small cookie. <laughs> but I enjoyed How it. How are you going to complain about I enjoyed yourself it though. and then eat like that? Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Trying to find a part to go find a part so that I can fix the part so that the part works. <laughs> yeah, that's about as basic. Okay, so English I guess that, that's we're, what we're about to do right now, and we're also gonna be going to the movies later. So I guess we're getting tickets right now. Oh, hell yeah, we're gonna go see the new version of the wall. I've never even seen, seen the first wall. Chinese wall, the Great Wall of China. Uh, I was thinking it was like some different, totally different type of movie. It's the wall. Where we're about to go see. The wall. The wall. It sounds but, mysterious. Yeah, it's kind of, I, I think. The wall. I think the idea behind it is that when they first built this wall, nobody really knows what they built the wall for. But in their version, it's to keep out like dragons or something. So. Dragon. I don't know. I think it's dragons. Because it wasn't trying to keep the Negroes out. Well, maybe. Man, no, China. China Negroes. <laughs> There's only one of those. Things. She's married to Kim Kardashian. Nope. Wait, what? Wait. <laughs> She's married to Kim Kardashian? No, her brother. Oh, Al Alfred Black Kardashian. China. Black China, see? Wow, you're an idiot. What the heck? Oh Black. my god, you guys. Hey. So we are about to go buy the tickets for the movie. The movie tickets! <laughs> At Triple A because we cheap as hell. Hey, if you can get them cheaper, why not, right? How you doing? Alright. Might as well. Actually buy the tickets? Oh, we're gonna take these and turn them into real tickets. Look, I got four black tickets. It even <laughs> says black ticket. Hey, everybody ever it's seen black, that before? No, just black Negro, black tickets. <laughs> 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 He's crazy, you guys. He's crazy. That is nuts. Crazy, crazy. The AMC and black ticket. I don't know if you guys know where the Tyler Galleria is, but I live in Riverside. Don't say it like it's depressing. It's not. Dep I mean, it's kind of depressing. We don't live in the in the hoop hoop ghetto like LA got some ghetto. But everybody. I know got, LA has some ghetto. LA got more <laughs> ghetto than it got famous places. Hmm. Oh man, we're going up the stairs of hell. It's a workout. I didn't eat enough to work out right now, though. Eat enough to work out? Yeah, burn calories. Eat cereal. Life. Yeah, but that's a lot of calories because you put milk in it. I don't drink milk, though. Unless it absorbs... It's food? No. I make sure it's out. So you dump the milk out of the spoon. So why yes. you eat with a fork, then? I don't know. Oh, look. Ah, uh, my legs hurt. Sick. Man, that makes you feel like a fat dude right there. Hey, that'd be funny if you're, uh, your uh Rihanna's mom yeah, was here. Uh, She's usually here. She probably is here. There's no one here. There's nobody here. Movie theaters isn't that important. Need tickets? Guess. We can help you inside. Thank you. Damn. Hey! Go inside. I it's that, huh? Yeah, we got. Now we turn our black tickets into white tickets. Look at this, we got four white tickets. They don't tickets. say white though. I uh, know they don't say white, but damn, can you say, what color can they be? Let's guess. They're the pink. They look white. <laughs> pink? <laughs> so we got four white tickets to go see The Wall at 7, seven o'clock. 
Yeah! I'm gonna I'm Cinnabon walking. really bad. Can you walk in there real quick? What time is it? That's annoying. Hell yeah, it's always a raggedy car that's got a alarm on it. What are you trying to say? Shit. If somebody wants. It's the Honda. There's nothing raggedy about That's raggedy. It. That's not, it's not raggedy, you guys. Honda is raggedy. I drove a Honda. Raggedy. That's just because you got keys to He's one of them. You're a hater, you guys. I'm He's not just hating. a hater. I'm not hating nothing. You're a hater. Hater. I'm not hating nothing. Hater. But. Hater, hater. If you want to steal my car, this is, I promise you. Come see Tyree. I'll give you keys and gas money. And as soon as you drive away, I'm calling my insurance company because I'm getting a new one. <laughs> uh, man. So I invite you to come steal my shit. Please do. Oh, Dad, you're wearing your Air Maxes. You can do little Air Maxes, dude. I like them. I, I uh, wear Air Maxes. What are you talking about? No, you're wearing Vans. Sexy now shoes. Now, Tyree. Vans. Hey, Vans are shoes sexy too. <laughs> Vans are sexy too. The How much did you get yours for? Weren't they like 50 or something? Nope. How much were they? They were normally 180. Guess how? Yeah, I know. Tyree got them for 39.95. Exactly. Mine were like, I don't know how much they were. So actually. who's who's the smart one? Who's got the better deal? Not yeah. you. Yeah, all me. See, no one in here. Yeah. We're in here, Dad. We are at the mall. I'm with Alicia. Alicia's with me. <laughs> we're together. At the mall, doing some shopping. Where there's no one. Yep, we're there's trying no to get discount some Cinnabons. <laughs> Wanted to go into Disney. You just walking straight through here. What the heck? I didn't even realize that we just walked through there. Oh, you want to go to the Star Wars stuff? Yeah, the clearance Star Wars stuff. Oh, <laughs> You're like the clearance Star Wars stuff. It's the black dude from Star Wars. Aaron Why got, is it to be the black dude? Because Aaron got mad at me that I didn't get the only black guy in Star Wars, so I had to get the guy. Well, Star who Wars. did you get before? I got all the other people. I got him, I got wow, him. Wow, and you didn't even get the black guy. Didn't get the black guy. But they had so many brothers that were for, on, on sale. So you're only getting the little ones? I got because they're heavy. Feel them. Okay. Oh, that's heavy. Because they're die cast. Those are die, those are die plastic. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess they're having a buy one get free at the Disney store tomorrow. back to twenty six ninety five, but then you'll get the second one free. Oh, okay. So Which right now they're 15 bucks, right, though. Right now they're 15 but if I will get one free, it'll be 14 almost. Like 13, 13 yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You have a great I'm day. I'm glad this is your excitement, Dad. Going to Disney. I want, this is the guy I want in the die cast, but they don't make it. Okay. But look, I got him. 10 bucks. Oh, <laughs> I got the deal. Okay, okay, I see what you're saying. Wait, which box are we gonna get then? The sixth one, might as well try to see it. Oh, this one looks good right here. <laughs> ah, <laughs> boom. So excited. Oh, mama. <laughs> oh my god. You guys, we have Cinnabons, and I cannot wait to tear these up when I get back home. Well, I'm not even gonna be able to eat one whole one. I'll she lying. She eat a whole pizza, sit there with a fork and a whole pizza, and not gain an ounce. Well, because it comes out, Dad. If I smell a pizza, I gain five pounds. You guys, if you haven't tried cinnamon, which I know there's people who haven't, you need to try it. I remember tweeting about it, and there's people that have never tried cinnamon. How are there people never tried cinnamon? They've never, there's people who have never been to Taco Bell. What? Yeah, Boy, Dad. you better get out there Taco and get the Taco Bell, Bell love. Taco Bell. This is Taco Bell every day, every night. Little crackhead Taco Bell woman right here. <laughs> My dad totally just tried to play off putting, off it, putting on his seatbelt and there's a cop like right there. I got it on though. Yeah, but I could tell what you're doing. Yeah, but I danced into my seatbelt. Hey, I got it on, nobody noticed. You don't wanna put me on blast. <laughs> Man, you the type of person to be like, hey, policeman. Why'd you pull us over? Because he wasn't wearing the seatbelt. <laughs> <laughs> no. Since it was funny watching you do that. I wish I would have recorded it. Like I told you earlier, see? You gotta catch everything. But see, I'm so smooth that if, if you'd have blinked, you wouldn't even know that I did it. Think about this. If you had a choice, would you rather date Darth Vader and have to listen to that breathing all the time and... <laughs> that sounds almost as annoying as he... Annoying as hearing people chew their mouth open. Though. Okay, but 
you had to kiss somebody who's always going. <sighs> okay, Darth Vader. <laughs> now, would you rather date Darth Vader and have to deal with that, but he has special powers, or Yoda, somebody you have to carry around in the backpack all the time? But Yoda's wise. He's green. He's got wrinkles. So he if you had to choose, that's exciting. If you had to choose, which one would you rather date? Yoda or Darth Vader? Yoda or Darth Vader? Um, I'll choose Yoda. Choose Yoda? Man, I, I can't listen to that breathing the whole time. What the heck? I would be so unattracted to him. I'd be like, that's ugly. That's not cute to me. But what if he had like a dentine smell when he breathed all the time? It just smelled the like. Fact they have to hear that 24 7. Who would you date? Yoda or Darth Whoa! Vader? Whoa! If, if, what if Darth Vader was a girl and Yoda was a girl? There you go. And the same problems. I, th I, th I think I'm taking Darth Vader because Darth Vader, on the low, low key, <laughs> Darth Vader got a pimp walk. He's brought all black. He got special powers. He can choke a nigga from a distance. Like, what did you say? <laughs> hey, you guys. So, a lot of you ask about my back tattoo and my existing tattoos, and I decided, hey, what? I might as well add it to the vlog I just did because my vlog wasn't all super exciting, and I might as well add, you know, something that you guys have been asking about. So. <laughs> um, I guess I could start off with my little tattoos. The first one I have, which is still one of my favorite ones because it correlates with my I Choose Happiness tattoo, and it is my self-love tattoo. My self-love tattoo hurt really bad. Wrist tattoos do not feel good. Um, but the thing about tattoos is it hurts so bad in the moment, but then it's like, I don't know, like five minutes after the set, like a few minutes after, it literally just feels like a big sunburn that has been slapped. I mean, it still doesn't sound pleasant, but it's still not as bad as how it feels when you get a tattoo. It's just like a very, very irritating feeling. Um, hmm. Okay, so I don't know how I'm going to show you guys my side tattoo. So I decided that I was just going to show you guys a picture of my side tattoo because it was kind of complicated to try to show the whole thing through the camera. But my side tattoo says, rest in peace great grandma Jeanette, forever loved and missed, 423.13. So I guess you could tell it is a memorial for my great grandma. Her name is Jeanette. She was an amazing, amazing, amazing woman and the ideal grandma that you see in like movies, literally. Um, it's actually a tattoo that I got redone. It used to be on my back in Hebrew because she's Jewish and it was just done completely wrong. You get what you pay for. So if you want something nice, you know, tattoos especially, go to someone good. The pain tolerance on my side was actually not bad until it kind of got up to like up here. Like it was a little bit more on my rib cage and then up. And that was the only time it hurt a little bit, but still the pain was probably like a... Mm, it was probably like a 6 out of 10 and it was super quick. My side tattoo took like 10 minutes. 10 minutes and that's like nothing. And my wrist tattoo even too took like maybe like 10 minutes, 5-10 minutes. Okay, so I decided to show you guys on camera rather than just like a simple picture. Um, so yeah, this is my spine tattoo which took about 4 hours. And these flowers are called stargazers, and they're actually my mom's favorite flower. Like I said, this is a cover-up of my grandma's um, memorial, and I decided, you know what, I had something that on my back that meant a lot to me, and so I want to get something for, you know, my mom that also means something to me. And I get asked a lot about the pain of this tattoo. That's what I get all the time. Did it hurt? I cannot lie to you guys. It was the worst pain I've ever gone through in my entire life. Would I do it again? No. Actually, I probably would because you forget about the pain. Tattoos, the pain does not last a long time. But it was like down lower. It wasn't too bad. And then it was like as soon as it started going up here, especially the neck, oh my god, I thought I was going to die. I was literally, my body was trembling, 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 trembling. And like I said, it took about four hours, and I sat through the whole thing. I think I took, like, one break, but it's like, 
it's kind of like you just kind of want to go through the whole thing because when you stop and then you get on that, you know, when they tap to the same spot again, it's just like, man, you know what, you're done for. It's just not a good pain. <laughs> Well, I hope that answered some of your guys' questions because I know it was really big on did the back tattoo hurt? That was the main question that I get all the time. And like I said, yes it did. It hurt really, really bad, but it was worth it. Very, very much worth it. It's my favorite tattoo. Just look-wise, it's my favorite tattoo. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm sorry it's uploaded a little bit later than expected. But I will see you guys next week, and the video is going to actually be about breakups. <laughs> um, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe down below. Love you guys.